Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to go check out our local spirit home. Yeah, in Las Vegas. So come get lost with us. Spirit Halloween in the lovely shopping center in the carcass of some old building. Looks like Save Mart. Oh my God. Right, inside. They have like a wall of stars, y'all. I'm guessing that's gonna fill up throughout the thing. It's gonna get real loud. Yep. I guess maybe we should start in the back and work our way to the front. Alright, when you first enter the store. I don't know what he's supposed to do. Oh, there you go. <laughs> cool. That's interesting. Next store. Just standing there. Uh, killer clowns from outer space. Can you step on it? Yes, he is rather tall. He's got to be about nine feet, is my guess. Yeah, thank you. Macy just watched that for the first time last year. You did too, right? No. Um, that was interesting. Maybe we'll watch it again this year. All right, another big old store. This is a pretty big one. Let's go check this out. Here lies Hugs the Clown. Aw, I could use a hug. And menacing Molly. This is my favorite part of the spirit store is these displays they put up every year. I'll check it out. You can actually see the spinning on camera. Hey guys, zoomed out a little bit so it looks better. That's pretty cool. Saw. Yeah. Nightcrawler. I love these cemetery. I love the displays. They're so awesome. Just tripped over. Did you know that this land is cursed? No, I did not. There's a farm here? They say it helped to keep his sword of lies and fur lies. Would you care to see where the remains lie? <laughs> he looks very angry. <laughs> His eyes closed, he'd be super freaking scary. <laughs> I know we were just talking about how we have too many clowns last night, but. Oh, awesome. Yes, please. Killer clowns, that's what I'm talking about. And he's got her in the goo thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's awesome. We have to get that. Okay. Alright, here's another angry lady. Nice, you gonna push your button? Yeah, it's nearly steadily brunette. It looks like that might hurt. Yeah. <laughs> but look what's around the corner. I uh, know, another killer clown, y'all. Mm. He's got his little bag uh, of popcorn. 400. I'd put real popcorn in there if he was in. I would, I would actually just put the trick or treat candy in there. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea though. Put... Oh, definitely. Yeah. He looks like a very friendly clown. I think he's only up to good. What do you think? Maybe. Yeah, he seems like he's only up to good. You think I should eat some of that popcorn? Yeah, I think we should just go for it. It's like a knitted oogie boogie. I see people on Etsy do those. <laughs> he's kind of cute. Yeah. 
spider webs in case you wanted to stretch out your house. I, as I said last year, I always wanted to do a graveyard. Check that out, eternal rest. That's cool. There's the straw man. Not heavy either. The black heart. We have not seen him yet. I think he's, he was here in some other people's videos. And Nate's talking about getting slim here. He's not heavy. You just buy him and pack him. <laughs> I'm being unrealistic. Yes. Scary sitting scarecrow. He was pretty cool. I saw him. The widow. <laughs> this would be awesome. A fogging skull pile, y'all. Then you have the man's best friend. Cujo was here last year. Oh, now he's named Bubba. That's funny. I'm pretty sure he's named Cujo last year. Little skelly bones. Pose and stay skeleton. Always a necessity if you're doing a setup. I used to sit in Scarecrow again. They got a lot of ham. And then a sinister spirit doll. No thanks. Hidden Disney. Yeah, that is a school cool yeah. head. Here lies the body of Emily Binks, beloved daughter. There's a Binks statue. It's sad that he wasn't actually in the uh, second one at all. And this is the Sanderson sisters house right here. Yeah. It's kind of fascinating if you wanted some salt and pepper shakers. I don't know why, but it's still so cool. <laughs> we got some beady juice. Beetle juice. I love the sign. It's so cool. <laughs> That's awesome, your face. Love it. Oh, they got him too. They got the bride and the groom. These are cool too. I like these retro signs. They make it look like what they did in the movie in the little town. That would work here because most people do have that uh, fake grass. Another hidden Disney haunted mansion. They're magnets. Interesting. They could be better quality. Yeah, I've never really been a big fan of the singing hats. I mean, it's a cool effect and all, but give me hat box. Constance Hatchway. They've really been pushing her in the last few years. Is there anything on the other side? Wow, this is dis this is disappointing. In the other stores we've seen, there were a ton of haunted mansion stuff. This one doesn't have much. It just kind of goes to generic occult stuff. That's cool. Crystal Witch. No. It is. Oh, wow. That's surprising. Interesting. I wonder what's in the uh, Wikipedia. Spellcrafting and witchcraft. <laughs> That's cool. They actually have stuff in the books now. The Book of Shadows. I think this one's just a notebook. All the good stuff, they leave the text out. Man, I didn't know Nacy's mom was here. That was surprising. That was surprising. Your mom's got some tricks. That was unexpected, y'all. That's pretty cool. I gotta admit. No, I didn't know you, and I didn't know you went that high. I was like, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's awesome. I would definitely scare a kid. Oh yeah. I also said that your mom in the graveyard, just so you know. I don't know how this one activates. I saw it open before. I don't know. I don't know how it opens. I knew, I knew he was in there, so I wasn't too scared, but that's cool, too. Uh, a couple things. That's the knocker. That's super awesome. <laughs> and then he pops out. It looks like he, like, sm like uh, spits something or something with his little nostril there. Kind of reminds me. He pops out air, maybe? Yeah, maybe, or smoke. 
He kind of reminds me of Hagrid's Fred. Mm -hmm. I was not expecting that. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. and she's just hanging out. Looks like she's at a rock concert, so that's not really that scary to me. She's like jamming out to the rock concert. He's still talking, by the way. So we got this guy. I know I, we've already seen this box, so we know kind of what happens. But I'm try to push the button. There we go. Really? Your life, your past. You will stay with me. Oh, that sounds fun. Okay, I can deal with that. <laughs> snacks, I'm always down for snacks, so. It's true, she is. I love the girl. Thank you for getting the shot. <laughs> These guys love those guts. I love it, I love the little guts. That's cool, that's cool. Yeah, I like that one. And we got another couple. <laughs> Okay. Oh. Oh, well, hello there. Hello there. I like your eyes. It's like an old teacher. Leave those kids alone. What's the grave do? I don't think he's working today. I don't think he's working. I don't think he's working, but he's still cool. I like the grave. Eternal rest. That's neat. I like the light up. Yeah, he's just like a little motion. Oh, he is. Yeah, that's cool. Here lies Lord Raven. A... Good old Fred, Madame Leota, hanging back to court. They had the faces and stuff in one of the other stores I saw. Either they sold out or they didn't have it to begin with. Oh, that's cute. It's a hanging zero. That's cute. I like that. Nightmare Before Christmas. Oh, I like the paper. Deadly Nightshade. Dun, dun, dun. I like that. <laughs> they have Operation Oogie Boogie down there. Some plushes. Pretty cool. This is awesome. It's like melted. I mean, it's metal too, y'all. That's pretty cool. Some trick or treat. I really. Michael Myers. I really feel like parents have brought their children here today to just terrorize them. Maybe. Another March. Oh, that's cool. It's like 3D esque. Oh, that's neat. Oh, it changes from the schematic to the actual gun. Oh, that's cool. I used to love this movie when I was a kid. Weirdly enough, I like watched this movie over and over and over again. So, uh, I was a weird kid who liked Mars Attacks. Okay, Crystal Light. Not a big like Halloween person. I'm not really like into slasher films, I guess. More or less into more like paranormal horror if I watch horror. All right, so the music just like amped up for some reason, but uh, there's Pennywise. Again, really cool, really cool signs. Uh, it's so cool, the little things that pop out of the popcorn. That's awesome. New little statues. Mm -hmm. huh, I wonder if it's... And they light up too. Oh, it's pretty hefty too. Oh, that's cool, I like that. 
That's got some weight to it, just so you know. Another Killer Clowns Reef. We've been thinking about doing a reef for Christmas. I don't know about for Halloween, but that's pretty cool. It's cool. I like Texas it. Chainsaw Massacre. It's $40 though. Oh, 40? it lights up. It lights up too. Oh, a little popcorn lights up. $40, huh? And a little... then there's this guy. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, the batteries don't work. Yeah, that's the joy of these things. Sometimes the batteries are already dead. So this is one of Nacy's favorite Halloween kind of costumes is nurses. So definitely if you see her and you're in a nurse costume ever, say hello. So is it like sexual torture? I don't understand this. Like is that like seizures? Or a lot of really fun times. All right, that's awesome. That's awesome. They have the Martian warrior, they got the saw. This kind of reminds me of Guardians 3. You got the uh, modified rabbit. You got the angry cat. Not really much as, but... Yeah. They got an inflatable as well. They got a ghost, a jack o' lantern, a reaper. I like the reaper. That's kind of neat. I like his colors. Gargoyle. Oh, they got a wolf. And a rat and a scarecrow. Ghost face. A hearse. I wonder how big the hearse is. 14 feet, y'all. That's cool. Jack o' lantern, a big old snake. I would definitely go with the hearse and the uh, reaper. Those are my preferences. Check out some of the horror costumes. <laughs> Unknown Phantom, Howling at the Moon, Light of Jack O' Lantern, Plague Doctor, that's cool. I remember them from like Assassin's Creed. Yeah, I saw a little girl with the hand one running around. It's kind of cute. Clown capture? Yeah, what's up? So we saw these last year. Thought about getting them. We didn't actually go through with it. That's pretty cool. There's a Haunted Mortals one. That's really cool. I like that. Our tour begins here. And I got... In this doorless chamber. Fun story though, and I'm seeing something over in the corner of my eye. The only costume I think I've ever bought in my life and never got to dress up as was a Barbie. And because the Barbie movie came out this year, Barbie is big. So um, yeah, I was a I was a Barbie for Halloween. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. So if you have a pup that's dressing up, that's awesome. I like the race car, ghost face. Can you imagine that thing running at you? <laughs> it, he's cute as it too. Now they don't seem to have any large ones, but they do have the small and mediums here. Oh, there's an extra large ghost face. So this is my favorite. We had, they had it last year, and I really love the colors. It's really awesome. All right, so if you're thinking about these, they are $22. Just you know. think about getting maybe not. I mean, uh, if, I think it would work in the garage, and then we need one for the front door. door. Yeah, let's we'll think about it. You know, a long time ago, I was like, oh, I want to get an old metal lunchbox to take to work. The only problem is, is that it leaks out all the coal, so it doesn't really keep it cool like back in the day. But I had an old school Doctor Who one that I used. It's a bobblehead. Aw, he's coming out of the toilet when you poop out the popcorn. Okay, Spirit Halloween, next year, you need something that goes over your toilet so when your guests come, it pops out of the toilet. How yeah. freaking hilarious would that be? There'd be diarrhea all on your walls. Because people wouldn't be able to hold it, they'd be so scared. And you gotta let me know, how many people buy earrings and stuff for Halloween? This shelf is full of these, and I picked one up, so I'm glad I did. Yeah. Victor and Emily from The Corpse Bride. It's not one of my favorite movies, but it's not bad. And then I have Billy Butcher, too. It's pretty cool. We are heading into the adult costume section. Gotta love the killer clowns. 
Chumba. The day he jumps out in a clown costume is the day that I don't know. I think he kind of fits me right there, right? It's about my size. Oh, I love the little blasters. It's awesome. That'd be cool if you could like. <laughs> if you could like find a way to prop them. <laughs> right. That's cool. Love it. Love it. I found a Rick and Morty gun. Nancy said it's not as nice as the Killer Clowns one. I have to agree. I think last year they had one that they had his portal gun and it actually put like green portals on the wall. Let's see that yet. Some Chucky knives. Wouldn't she be Bride of Chucky? I'm just throwing that one out there. I'm not, I'm not really sure, but I feel like she wouldn't be Chucky. She would be Chucky's bride, right? <laughs> they even have this head sledgehammer, that's awesome. The clown hammer. Check out the Beetlejuice stuff. Ooh, let's get a Beetlejuice mask, that's cool. Barbara and Adam mask. And then you got some Nightmare Before Christmas. Awesome. They have the mayor too. Jack, obviously. That's Oogie Boogie. That doesn't really look like Oogie Boogie. <laughs> Got some SpongeBob for you. I think it's kind of funny. I thought that this was Aquaman, and I'm like, why is Aquaman over here? I, I didn't watch SpongeBob as a kid, y'all. It was a little after my time. Check out the Mickey. It's weird they don't have a mini right next to them, but there's the Mickey stuff. <laughs> you even get a tail. Oh, there's the portal gun. Ah, there's the portal gun. So it's just in the wrong area. It would be Pickle Rick or Rick. No Morty though. Morty's important, folks. Morty's important. Oh, check out the hat. It's kind of cool. Sorry about that. A little too zoomed in. It's like glossy. It's interesting. Macy said that is her Halloween costume, Ariel. Is the Ursula one too? Oh, check out the Ursula. Two sexy princesses. I guess they're more adult princesses. I don't know if you would call them sexy. Yeah. Cosmetics. I'm sure they're great. Princess hair clips. That's cool. Pizza plan shirt in case you want to do a pizza delivery dare. That would be fun to just get to like where to the parks too. Yeah, you could definitely Disney bound with that when it's not a thousand degrees outside. Yeah, this would definitely be an easy, um, like Mickey's not so scary or like a Oogie Oh yeah, yeah, costume. yeah. One year we'll go and we'll dress up and maybe we'll let you guys pick our costume. We'll give you like a choice. Maybe next year. Maybe next year. Yeah. Macy's found her childhood. Just a Barbie. Barbie. Weird Barbie. I don't understand what makes her weird. Pink power jumps. It's interesting the ebbs and flows from year to year. They had a huge Harley Quinn selection last year because she had that movie, I think, come out. Now there's a few costumes and they still have a little things, but not nearly as much. Some more inflatables to go for Oh, look at that, they got Taz. Garfield, Porky Pig. Biddy biddy biddy, that's all, folks. Yes, Stay Pub. I want to do that one. Ecto glasses. Oh, we got a walkie talkie this time. PKE meter. And of course the proton packs. I do wonder how nice the proton packs are. Oh, and then Nacy got a Ted Lasso. All you need is a mustache and a nice shirt. They have Average Joes. How old of a movie is that? It's a great movie. I'm surprised to see it, honestly. Oh, they got Step Brothers too. Wonka. Willy Wonka. There is that new Willy Wonka movie coming out. Oh, that makes sense. 
Yeah, when's the new season of the Stranger Things coming out, anybody? Anybody know the last season? Powderpuff Girls? They canceled that show, so I'm surprised that the Powerpuff Girls are here. I said Powderpuff there. Where's Waldo? I found him, I found him. For all you Harry Potter fans, we got a wall. It's not very big, but they got some other stuff. Honestly, if you live in Orlando, Universal's probably a better place to get costumes. But, uh, I like the headwig though. They got the Hermione skirt. Nice headwig. They have a whole Top Gun display with his aviators. They got his jacket. I think it's missing a few patches, I feel, but... Okay. Flight suit. They don't have the uh, volleyball set, though. I feel like you need that as well for a cost if you're going to do Top Gun. <laughs> this is weird. I'm sorry. This is just weird. The Yellowstone branding uh, temporary tattoo. Oh, it's even got adhesive glue to stick to your skin. <laughs> All right, then. So you can look like you've been branded. Yes, that's what I was just talking about. You can be my rip. Your buff. Man, I'm crazy like that. Yeah, you are crazy. I don't understand. Are you supposed to baptize someone with this? Do you just, like, smack them till they're baptized? Is that, that what this is for? Because I'm, I'm definitely new at this. I walked past this row and Nace is like, oh, you missed another nurse joke because I hate it so much. So I figured I would just come over here and do another nurse joke. It's funny, he's got his butt out. There you go. There you go, Nace. You sassy nurse. Are you nurse scrubs or are you sassy nurse? Or classic nurse? Or cardiac arrest nurse? Which one are you? Which one she says no. You won't even participate, but she wanted me to go to the side for some reason. It's funny how they have. Which one would you rather I be? Oh, it's you. Uh, they have the schoolgirl outfits right next to the nurses. Not really sure of the correlation there, but you have to let me know. Those are my go-to's. Uh, no, there's a correlation. I just figured it out. In high school, these were my go-to's. Get a plaid skirt, you get some knee highs, and some black shoes. So make sure you check out the full store because in the clearance section they have a uh, floatsome and jetsum. I was going to say Corella, that's wrong. For, uh, Ursula. for Ursula. Brain fart. How many folks out there do the uh, couples costumes like peanut butter and jelly, milk and chocolate, milk and cookie? I said milk and chocolate chip cookie. Breathalyzer. It's missing. The hull, I think, needs to be a little lower, doesn't it? Yeah. There you go. The hull needs to be a little bit lower. Inflatable sumo. Want to be pickle Rick, but just a pickle. It's nice that this is more her saying the penguin outfit. Another couple's outfit, chips and salsa, y'all. I guess she's dipping in his salsa. Black skin. Yes, that's that's what I was wondering as well. Why she's dipping in his salsa? Yes, unless uh, she has a fetish that we don't know about. If you want to do Halloween, but you just kind of want to be lazy about it, you can just get like a hat, beer hat, shark hat. I like the frog hat, he's cute. Horse head. Tons of wigs, y'all. So in case you had any kind of like, you know, needs or desires for wigs. Wow, there's a lot. It's interesting that we come to these stores and they're not fully set up yet. But this is Vegas, y'all. In case you're interested in the Yellowstone thing, they have some other ones too. You can put some scars on yourself. Prosthetics. It's fascinating, the uh, eye one. Oof. Well, I mean the eye one too, but this is the one I was talking about. Very interesting, kind of simple Halloween decor for some people who rent, maybe. Door covers. I like the Mars Attacks one, that's pretty cool. Ghost face is always good. I think I'd go either Gremlins or Mars Attacks here. Yeah. <laughs> so cool, look at them, they're so cool. Ah, uh, my favorite. Kind of generic this year, I have to be honest. A lot of rest in peace ones, which are nice, but I like the ones with the names, like the creative ones. Pet Graveyard. Oh, 
All right, that concludes our trip around the Spirit Halloween store here in Las Vegas. What'd you think? That's really nice. Um, I am a little sad they don't have a, a lot of the Mars Attack stuff at this location. So I'll probably try and check out some of the other ones later on this week, maybe, and see if we can find those um, Mars Attacks ones, because I do want to see those. Yeah, same thing with the Haunted Mansion. We watched a couple people go to like the demo stores as well as some other stores not in Las Vegas. And they had a lot more stuff for Haunted Mansion as well as Mars Attacks. So yeah. interested in seeing. But we did get to see all the animatronics, so that's cool. And yeah. totally worth a visit. I mean, yeah. it's kind of weird. There's so many kids out here, but... Yeah, so make sure before you do go, though, that you look at their website so you can see which ones are actually open and when they're open because they all open with different time frames and they all have different stuff, so keep that in mind. Yeah, that's definitely a legit tip. If you're looking for one, don't use Google. Definitely go straight to the Spirit website. So I hope you guys enjoyed tagging along with us, and if you did, give us a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. And make sure you ring that notification bell so that way you get notified when we do at least three videos a week. And we'll come and get you for the next one. Ain't that the truth, baby? Bye!